pain on my foot. Mamá, te hice un dibujo. Ay, wow. ¿Te gustó? Sí, es perfecto. ¡Hurra! Este va directamente al refri. No hay mucho espacio aquí arriba. Mm, mira, voy a ponerlo encima del de Bluey por ahora. Oh, hola Bluey. Yeah. See you later. All the details for my son's Bluey birthday party. When guests first walked in, they were greeted with paw print floor decals and a welcome sign. One of the first things they saw was this backdrop. I love how this layered look came out. We added some custom decals and balloons. In front of the backdrop, we had a kid's table and chair set. We added some floral arrangements. These plate centerpiece details were so cute. The party favors were Bluey themed Play-Doh kits. All the acrylic signs had fun Bluey phrases. The cake sat beside the party favors. We also had this little cutout of Bluey. My son was so excited to see everything. We also had this bubble house. It is Always such a hit with both the kids and adults. We had another decal with a bluey phrase right outside the bubble house. I loved these vinyl decals everywhere. They added such a special touch. We had a ball pit with slides. It's one of my son's favorite things, so I had to include it. Right beside that, we had a bounce house. We added a balloon garland on top. And another bluey phrase decal on the back. The kids had so much fun with this one, too. Next, we had bluey-themed treats. I loved all the detail in the cookies. And everyone loved these bite-sized cupcakes. We had a mobile bar offer signature drinks for our guests. Custom drink stirs and a bar sign. They were seriously amazing, and I wanted to do something fun for the parents. They also had kids juice pouches. I thought those were so cute. After everyone arrived to the party, we were so excited because Bluey came to visit the kids. They were so excited and surprised to see Bluey. They played together, took pictures. Bluey even helped us sing happy birthday to my son, Kellen. Kellen loves when people sing to him. It's so sweet. We had quite the full house. It makes my heart so happy seeing everyone get together. We had the best time celebrating with friends and family. It was truly such a special day. And I'm so thankful to all the vendors who made this day happy. a Bluey o a un perro en un minuto. Vamos a iniciar dibujando el cuerpo, el cual es un rectángulo. Las orejas son dos triángulos. Para las piernas hacemos dos rectángulos y para las patas dos círculos cortados a la mitad. Ahora haremos los ojos. Un poquito más arriba de la mitad del cuerpo vamos a hacer dos ovarios. Ten cuidado y no los hagas muy separados el uno del otro. Ahora vamos a hacer el hocico. Un poquito más abajo de la línea del ojo derecho vamos a iniciar esta forma de empanada, de taquito, como prefieras decirle. Y le agregamos esta ligera curva para la sonrisa. Y le agregamos la nariz, la cual es un triángulo. Le agregamos la pupila a los ojos, que son dos ovalos. Y ahora vamos por el brazo. Es un rectángulo más o menos del mismo largo del de las piernas. Y para los dedos es como cuando estás dibujando nubes. Agregas tres circulitos. Uno, dos y tres. Ahora marcaré la panza y el interior de las orejas. Y dibujaremos las cejas, las cuales son como dos frijoles. Solo nos falta la colita. Aquí es muy similar a la mano. Agregamos uno, dos, tres y cuatro círculos. Y listo, ya es la hora de colorear. Diviértete y mándame tu resultado. Los voy a estar compartiendo. And now, please welcome Dr. Bandit Gila, fresh from the field to discuss his latest archaeological discovery. <coughs> Good evening. Behold, the only known fossil of the first dog to walk upright, the ancestor of us all. This bone belonged to an early canid that walked the earth over four million years ago. Our reconstruction suggests this species was a primitive but intelligent toolmaker. Note the derived morphology of the femur. It's pronounced robusticity and rugged muscle attachments. This mosaic of characters is indisputable evidence for bipedal locomotion and evolutionary descent from a quadrupedal antecedent. This is a singular find of unprecedented significance for our understanding of the origin of modern dogs. It is a rare relic from our distant past. Living you.
Utah and I couldn't find a bluey pinata, so I'm gonna have to make one. I picked this up at Target for $5 and I'm gonna be cutting out the Healer family and putting that to the side. This is what it came with and I'm just gonna put that over somewhere where it's not in my way. <laughs> I took off the cellophane layer from the pinata and it's super easy. It literally just ripped off and I tried to make it as clean as possible. Put in my Healer family to see if it fit, cut down Nemo a little bit, and then also cut out the blue logo and super glue this down, or hot glue this down, and cut out the blue logo so you don't see any trace of Nemo. Then I'm going to be taking my roll of cellophane, it has to be clear, not sparkly or anything, and cut it to size. I suggest having a buddy for this because my friend helped so much with this process, this entire process, and she really helped so much when she was pulling it like you could see there to make sure it was tight as possible and there you go that's it it was super easy and it looks amazing Muffin, no! Ow! Biscuits! No! Oh, why does Muffin get an ice cream? Muffin's not getting an ice cream. I got an ice cream! Ice cream. Tuna Cross, what's your favorite food? Children. I'm in a bath now and I'm doing the dishes. More dirty dishes for you. Thanks, boss. <laughs> yes! <laughs> <Whoa>. <laughs> Just give this a whack. Watch out, mate. Oops. Oh, yes. Can we get the bill, please? Oh, can we get the bill? Louie, inside voice. Oh, can we get the bill? Is Bingo gonna... Mama, te hice un dibujo. Oh, wow. ¿Te gustó? Sí, es perfecto. Hurra. Este va directamente al refri. No hay mucho espacio aquí arriba. Mira, voy a ponerlo encima del de Bluey por ahora. Oh, hola Bluey. This episode of Bluey is called. Okay, kids, in the bed. Come on, Big D's ready for knockoff. Oh, whack it do. I won't be messing with you. But I wanna do the ballerina! Goodness me! I'm up! Hey, you have a wife! Whoa! She bit me! Whee! Oh, whoa, oh, no! Yeah. Okay, from now on, no one makes any more promises. But you promised you'd always love us! Whoa, well, I didn't think it's through. Yeah. How does the baby get in the lady's belly? Sometimes special people come into our lives, stay for a bit, and then they have to go. But that's sad. It is. But the bit where they were here was happy, wasn't it? Yeah. We caught a wild pig together. Maybe that makes it all worth it. Are you okay? My mum left me behind. She didn't. You just got mixed up in the slide. She's just over there. Mackenzie! Hey, Mum! See? There she is. Mackenzie, 
You know what's here now. You don't need to keep coming back to this place. Okay. Monkey singing songs, mate. Don't think too hard about it. We can't make him feel better. No, wake up, mate. Ow, Bluey. Okay. Will the doctor be much longer? I'll just be patient. Freedom! I've got good news. Your bird is okay. Oh, no, no, Mum, you have to pretend it's bad news that the budgie's dead. Oh. Look at me. How do you say no? No. 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 Good morning, Uncle Gorgeous. How much is this? Oh, uh, so buy four, get one free. I'll have the free one. No, gorgeous. You mean to pay for this? Gorgeous! Yeah. I'm a hippie-uppie expert. Dear child, embrace your father. Oh, Tommy, hear me. me. He's malfunctioning. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come back here, guinea pig. Cheese and crackers. My name is Daddy Robo. <laughs> I got the water bottles in a two pack from the Target dollar spot and they have different lids. It's one like this and then one like this. The two pack was $3, so $1.50 each. I got some people saying that they would have a hard time taking stuff out of the cup. I ordered all the paper sets from a store on Etsy and I think it was like $4 for the set. And then I just printed them at Office Depot and went and picked them up. I think it was less than $10 to print all of them. And I did a set of 12 for everything. Then the balloons I got at the dollar store, I just cut on the paper right here 
and then pulled the balloon through. And then for the other ones, I just taped them to the paper. Super simple. All the little, the burgers, the sticky geckos, and the stuff I got on Amazon is linked in my store. And then these are finger puppets I got from Target. I think it was $1.50 for a pack of eight. So that wasn't too bad. The granny glasses I just bought on Amazon and then the paper didn't come with the template, but I just opened the legs up in the back, sliced where they go, and then you can just push it on there. So they attach. Really early. Spin it! She rolled over! She rolled over! <laughs> She's not meant to do that for ages! Aw, oh, that's my girl! Ah. Hold on, Mama. You can do it. You can do it! Did I do it? Goodbye, Uncle Strawberry. See you, mate. Now, you have to finish that before we get on the ferry, Muffy. Ah! Be fair. Okay. I'll get strawberry, please. In a curry. I can always have a look at bingo. My baby, my baby, you're my baby, say it to me. Army. How do you know so much about the army? Because what it adds in the army. Is he on patrol like us? Yeah, but not for long. Well, that's good. He said when he comes back, he's got to bring me some condensed milk. Ah, oh, I love condensed milk. Rusty, no! <laughs> What was she to do? Make shoes! Oh, Bluey! Oh, I know! Unicorns, what's your favourite food? Children. Oh. Good morning, Uncle Gorgeous. How much is this? Oh, uh, so buy four, get one free. I love the free one. No, Gorgeous, you mean to pay for this? Gorgeous! Shakira, Shakira. I never really knew that she could. It's a pain on my foot. <laughs>
I am hungry. A special kid in the world? Yes. Well, you're not. Oh. Guess what? What? I'm not special anymore. Children. Oh. <laughs> My heart is breaking. I said horses can't talk. Oh, I mean, no. <laughs> Excuse me? Oh, let go! Ribbon! Uh, I'll come back another time. Why do we have to have manners? Because we're not animals. Why are you hopping? I peed on my foot. <laughs>
brought a special element to the party. Next was the backdrop setup. There were so many vendors involved in this process. It's always so fun to see what it ends up looking like from start to finish. All of the party desserts were next. We had a Bluey themed cake, cupcakes, cookies. So I set everything out on the dessert table for the guests. The ball pit with slides was next. This is always such a hit with the kids. I finished up the little things like setting out snacks. While the floor is set up the flowers. Then I moved on to the kids table. I placed cheesecloth table runners on the table first. Then I did a set of layered plates. More acrylic details. I love these plate centerpieces. I put one on each plate setting. And I finished the look with some floral centerpieces. Stay tuned to see how this party turns out. I was on Facebook this morning and I saw this. At first I thought it was fake, but it's real. That is Bluey's mom, Miss Chili Healer, on the cover of Australians in Style magazine. As deserved. I want to say this because I know I'm not alone in this. My favorite TV mom right now is a cartoon dog and I don't care. With my family of four and I to a Bluey themed birthday party. My kids have really recently started to love Bluey and her sister Bingo, so they were really excited about this theme. We walked straight in, they had a bubble house, which is always a huge hit with the kids, and the birthday boy was already ready to party. My best friend Kristen threw this party for her son turning two, and I love how she took the Bluey theme and modernized the colors of it. I think it's obvious what the kids' favorite activities were at the party, but she made sure not to leave out the adults' favorite activity too. That was a joke, by the way. Maybe. Now, onto the kids' table. I'm a sucker for checkered anything, so I loved the plates and these cute little acrylic placeholders. Then the yummy cake and these favorites, which were actually practical and we got a lot of use out of them when we got home. You know it's a win when you get a family shot at a birthday party, just in time for Bluey to walk in the door. My youngest, well, he took a second to warm up. We gave him a real good inspection and then he decided he was safe, so we got a wave out of him. She did such a good job at entertaining both the kids and the adults and I'm starting to believe that that's such an important part of the party because as parents, I swear I spend half my life at kids' parties now. And although that's not a bad thing, it's nice to have some adult interaction too. You feel me? Now follow along for more party content because you know I've got it. As a mom, this episode of Bluey had me bawling. 